This is Isa from Printstick and in this video I will show you how to use bookmarks in GoodNotes. So what bookmarks do is that they allow you to easily navigate your planner similar to what you can do with your links. These are all links that I'm tapping on on the bar on the right side of my planner. One little thing first, if you click on the top left corner on the four squares icon right here, you can see all of the pages included in your planner and you can i mean they're small but you can really tell what they are so for example i can see that this number three is the yearly calendar i can also see that number one is the cover or the first page of the planner i have this number two page where i have some information and some answers to some common questions and i would like to be able to go back to this page easily so what i do is i click on those four squares on the top left corner and then at the bottom here you go where it says bookmarks tap there and then just click on the plus sign up here on the left and enter the name so for example i will call this faq name it whatever you want and hit ok and then that created a bookmark of this page where i was at so if i get out of here and then i want to quickly access that bookmark i just click on these four squares and click on whichever page i want another example i'm gonna give you if i go to my daily page First of all, I have to copy this one. So to do that, click on these squares again, but now go back to thumbnails down here. As you can see, this is uh, selected in blue. That's the page I wanna copy. So click on edit, tap on it. Now it's selected, hit copy on the bottom left, hit done. And now to add it, click plus and whatever in the planner you want to add it, that's on that's where you would click on that plus sign right now i want to add it right after this same daily page so right here i'm going to click paste copy pages and you will repeat as many times as you need for example i'm going to make seven copies of these pages one two three four five six one more great now i have seven copies and i can do this behind every week of the planner and I can just rename them as bookmarks. So if I go to my bookmark section in the middle, I just click on the plus sign and enter the title. So for example, this could be July 7th. Okay, then you can move on to the next page and you can't really tell because they're exactly the same, but let's say let's write here. July 7. So now you know that this is a different page than this one. For example, let's write, oops, let's write here July 8. And when I go bookmark this page, again, click on bookmarks, plus sign, and enter the title. Okay. So when I go back up there, I can just go to July 7 or July 8. All right, guys, so that is how you use bookmarks in GoodNotes. It's really helpful. It's almost the same as having links for any page that you want. And once you start copying and adding a lot of pages to your planner, it can become really useful. Thank you so much for watching. Give this video a thumbs up if you liked it to let me know. And don't forget to subscribe since I'm going to be uploading more video tutorials for GoodNotes and giving you a lot of tips on how to use your digital planner. You can leave any questions you have in the comment section below and I'll get back to you as quick as I can.